showing y'all 10 Fortnite tips for console. So these are just to help you if you didn't know them yet. If you do know them, that's great. Um, so. so the first one is gonna be a countdown. So I just gonna start from 10, okay? Uh, coming, I so saw the number 10. Look behind you every once in a while. You will not believe how many times you get killed just because you've gotten attacked from behind. It's ridiculous. Uh, like, do it. You you should uh, put your sensitivity a little up if you if you are comfortable with putting it up. That way, uh, you can like do a quick spin, like. Uh, a little three, one, uh, a little uh, like ninety degree turn. Wait, yeah, wait. No, a three sixty degree turn. You can, you can do a three sixty degree turn because you need to look around you too. And I'm at yeah. And ninety is to your. So you need to look at a 360 degree so spin around every few seconds. Coming in at number nine, change your controls to what you prefer. All right, so if you don't know how to change your controls, you're gonna hit options. You're going to go to the settings icon. You're gonna hit X if you're on PS4. And you hit R1 again 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 until you see wireless controller and so you'll see a screen that looks like this and there are combat pro quick build or standard and this is the controls for combat control quick builder standard uh so uh just use the one that you prefer like a lot of people give you reasons why to use a certain one but use the ones that you're comfortable with and so number eight don't loot too much grab a few material and guns and go so what this means is i know this game's all about building and all that and then so, you don't need to get too much because you won't believe how many p people you'll find just breaking down trees or houses or factories. And uh, you can easily just shoot them and they not even expect it. You, I know you do need at least a few materials, so I get like 200 about 400 but you don't need a ridiculous amount like 999 unless you're trying to build a tower or a wide and tall tower number seven don't be too trigger happy so uh, if you don't know what trigger happy means, it's basically where you keep on, you like keep on shooting. All right. Sometimes it's even for no reason. Uh, so there's a lot of people when they have an AR, they don't stop firing. So they like spam their R2 button. Uh, but that is wasting a lot of bullets. And you need bullets in this game very badly. And also your accuracy is gonna be a little off if you're too true or happy. Number six, don't get in a fight if they have higher ground unless you know you're going to kill them. So this game, higher ground is a big thing in this game. Cause you can just jump off and headshot them very very easily and they have to 
aim up and then they have to aim down as you're falling and then by the time you've fallen down you, they probably you've probably already shot them number five don't run a lot so yeah, I know you have to run to get to the circle if the storm's coming or something but if you're running for no reason you're just trying to leave the city and then just like walk or not walk but just you can run just like look around you this is like number 10 just you need to check your surroundings very bad number four don't shoot unless you know your surroundings so a lot of times you'll find like a solo and like he has like a pistol and you got like a shotgun so you go up there and you shoot him and you kill him and then heck and then about a second later someone comes up behind you and starts to shoot you and you've probably done weakened from the guy with the pistol because he might get a one shot off of you uh oh yeah number three don't pick the wrong gun pick the one you prefer okay right, so if you if okay so let's use the tactical shotgun for example uh, it has it's really gone down and liking because uh it's really bad with like it does like it doesn't do like a lot of damage it doesn't do a lot of damage and the, so so you find a purple tack and you go up to it and you place a gray pump board that is like in my opinion that's better than because get actually shooting them instead of not getting a shot is a good difference you can pick a but if you like the tactical then you should pick the purple one number two check your surroundings at all times okay so this goes along with number five number four and number ten and number eight and number six uh goes with a lot of them because it's a very very important thing in Fortnite because all of a sudden you'll run and then to get to the circle and then right beside you there's a fort and then they'll just shoot you down shoot you number one don't get too nervous this happens a lot to me all right. I'll shoot someone with a shotgun, I'll knock their shoot off, and then uh, I'll get a little happy, and then I'll get a little nervous, and then they'll come, and they'll jump. This uh, has to do with number six also, because they'll like get the higher ground most of the time, and then they would jump down and do the headshot. That is 10 Fortnite tips for Kanto. Hope they helped you. I hope you got a win right after you've seen this video. That would be awesome. Uh, please hit the thumbs up button and subscribe. But for now, 